The seagull is a fascinating creature. It takes to the land, the sea, and the air, but is a master of none. It lives in every part of the world, but dominates nowhere. So we must ask of this gull, why? Why the gull? What is the gull's purpose? But then, what is our purpose? Why, indeed, anything? The gall will die. We will die. And then we must ask, why, why, why? The Yanks manager gave me a job as coach for as long as you're... Let's spend a quiet week in Lake Wobegon, Minnesota. Gulls live in flocks, like so many sheep of the sky, following their leader from cloud to cloud. But who is the leader? Are any of the Gauls really the leader? Or are they all the leader? And all followers at the same time? The gull has wings, does it not? They have never found an albino gull. Yes, indeed, you may ask. Are gulls not already white? Yes, they are. The gull is well known to follow the fisherman's boat. Are they after the fisherman's catch? The fisherman thinks so. Why is it that the gall flies against the wind when it knows it will go nowhere? Why do any of us fly against life when we know in the end we will die? The gull often flies in a circle, around and around and around, never getting anywhere new.
I like going to the beach. When you feed the seagulls on the shore, is it you that are feeding them, or are they feeding you? Unlike many other birds, the gall does not migrate. It does not in the winter seek the warmth of the south. It instead chooses to stay. Do any of us really stay 